All right, so back on social media. I have been on social media in a, a while. Took a sabbatical. Didn't know if I was going to come back to it or not. Uh, but social media became a real problem for me. You know, I was just one as a father. I would just be on my phone swiping and swiping for hours and hours and while my kids were just, you know, watching TV or, you know, they wanted my attention. And I'd be like, in a minute, in a minute, you know, that minute just turns into hours, you know, swiping through your phone, looking at nothing. Most of the time looking at stuff I shouldn't be looking at anyway, you know. Um, social media was also becoming a, it was creating a gap between me and my wife and between our, our intimacy because um, I was using it to feed, you know, uh, lust. Lust was my largest problem since my early childhood. It definitely affected any relationship I ever had with a woman or with a girl all through uh, my adolescence, um, all through school, um, and it affected my relationship hard. Um, and so uh, to help get away from that, as well as running and giving everything to Christ, I uh, took a break. And so, but now I'm back. Now, my biggest thing now is to become a true disciple, uh, to live in the Word of God. As John 8, 31 says, the Word of God is God's own Word. If we are His followers, we must do what He says. We can only hear what He says through reading the Bible. Um, we're to serve others, and so I would like to serve, you know, my, my friends, my family, um, the youth, other men, you know. As Christ's true disciples, we have to live as Christ lived in the world. Christ came to the world to serve and not to be served. Just as Christ came to serve, we as his disciples have to serve too. So, you know, I want to serve to others. I want to help them through their struggles, through their sins that they may be going through and let them know that they're not alone, that uh, Christ meets you exactly where you are. He doesn't wait for you to come to where he is. He doesn't wait for you to clean your life up. And so um, through this new reassurgence of my uh, social media account, I'm going to be posting videos, hopefully daily, um, but we'll start off with weekly, going through my daily devotions, um, anything that God lays on my heart to share. Um, and the biggest thing is I'm going to be open and honest and just unashamed of who I am, what I've struggled with, what I continue to struggle with, and being completely unashamed of being a follower of Jesus Christ. And that's what I am. So you guys take care. We'll post more videos later.